Hello again guys, today we have this flight helmet and as you see in this modeling process I'm just doing some manipulating to the board and I'm gonna just comment on the important steps. So as you see in the whole process this looks like I'm just manipulating here and moving some vertices around and edges and just beveling and subdividing. So I'm just going to stop a little or slow down a little on this importing stuff and we had today a tip and one trick. In this section here I just want to get one body, I don't need these two bodies because I'm just selecting or activating the mirror so it's, it gives me two bodies. So I'm just going to take this half and delete it and I'm going to select these edges and make sure it's flattened. So I'm going to select this edges manually and move this cursor to make it flat then I'm gonna select on mirror now got one body
Now here I just need to convert this to the solid body so I'm gonna just use quad fill here and give it a little creasing move it a little and here we go now this should be just full solid part Using a soft selection is going to help you a lot to manipulating the movement like you just don't need to move one surface it's just moving it more organically you also have a slide bar to control how much you need or how much the level of soft selection Now check that error with me, 
when I try to create a bridge between these two bodies so it's gonna fail making the bridge because if the inside body is inverted so we need to flip this inside body I'm gonna go to the tools and I'm gonna select flip selected faces so now you got the same R like each other and can now do the bridge without any problems. Now let's get over to the track. When I need to convert a a surface to a solid body manually I'm just going to combine it take the copy and scale it a little down and I'm going to delete this outer loop and as you notice here it's flip it same as the other body so I'm gonna flip it back to be the same let's go to the mask tools level selected faces so now you got it you can just do in the bridge easily selecting the both edges and done I'm gonna just crease this part here to match the other creasing here so I'm gonna fix this part now you should got this whole full solid body let's just crease this also the new added edge now you can see that I have a solid bodies these two solid bodies that I just created manually by bridging
Thank you.